Hey, welcome back to the channel. It's Tuesday night. You know what that means. Stoking up the fire, getting the shop warmed up. When the guys get over here, we'll see. Are we going to get anything done on the Jeep tonight? Or are we just going to empty some shiner bottles? Stick around. All right. Jeremy came over behind the camera again with uh, he got a new ultrasonic cleaner for early Christmas present. So we got some of the carb parts in here. We're gonna dip these for a little while and, and see how it gives this thing a brand new tester on here. Got the, well, I should have went slow, but good thing it didn't disperse all the water. So distilled water and distilled white vinegar. So what do we think, about a half an hour? Oh, 30 minutes. Yep. Okay, so 30 minutes, 32 seconds. We want it at 60 degrees. Oh, yeah, 70. And that's current actual. Yeah. 60 is about 140 Fahrenheit. All right. We're going to let this ride for a little while. And see if we can find some shiner or something else to do. I'm voting for the shiner. All right, we just went past 11 minutes, so we're almost 20 minutes into it. And uh, yeah, you can't even see the parts. The water's so cloudy, meaning that the water's really dirty. Parts are getting cleaner, obviously. So looks like it's worked pretty good. That side dropped in, so yeah. I'm glad that wasn't like really hot. I didn't even think about it. Stuck in me. Do not watch my videos for safety. Yeah, don't watch my videos for safety. I just blindly stuck my fingers in there. I wasn't sure how hot it was. I didn't even think about it. But it ain't steaming, so. But if you've watched my videos, if you've watched me on the wire wheel or with any power tools, don't watch this for safety. <laughs> Let's take a quick look and see how they're doing. Oh yeah, those look a lot better. I don't know how well you could see them on the camera when we threw them in there. It didn't really show them to you very well, but. They're looking a lot better already. That's awesome. All right, so I didn't have the camera because I didn't want to get my hands all over my camera with all this crap on them. So we got the uh, carburetor out of the Sonic cleaner. Put a little fogging oil on it to uh, on the parts to keep them clean and bagged them till we're ready. So hopefully those will stay good and clean and not have to do this again because I don't know when we're actually going to get to putting it together and uh, getting fuel in it, but um, for now they're cleaned, they're bagged, and we'll see what we get to next.